Hey guys, Hassan here. In this video, I'm going to check out the Godox VK1 VLOG kit and I'm going to show you how you can use it for mobile filmmaking. I want to thank Godox for sending me out the VK1 for reviewing. Of course, I will tell you my independent personal experience about it. Let's start. The package contains the Godox VK1, an RGB LED video light, a mic, a dead cat, and a bag, beside to the USB-C to 3.5mm TRRS cable. You can find my full unboxing video in the descriptions. First things first, I was expecting an aluminum alloy body here. But after using it for a while, I'm good with the polycarbonate body because of its exceptionally light. And I don't need any side handle, which would add unnecessary weight on it. On the top, we get three cold shoe mounts and two one quarter inch mounts. On each side and on the bottom, we get one quarter inch mounts. I can easily install the included mic and the video light on the cold shoe mount and go for it. Besides this, I can also install my Manfrotto mounting plate on the bottom to use my newer carbon fiber tripod. The included tripod is great. I really like it. It's expandable and a great add-on for the VLOG kit. I'm just expanding it and start live streaming or VLOGing. The included LED video light is very bright. In comparison, I have also an indoor video light but the Godox LED 6R looks more promising to me. My Andor video light doesn't have a separate power button, like on the Godox 6R video light. It's very tricky to power it on and off, like shown here. I can simply turn the switch on here to power it up. Thumbs up here. Beside the power button, we also get an FX manual up and down buttons. I can change the lighting mode using the FX button. If I want to go for the normal lighting, I can just press the manual button and go for it. Of course, I can use the up and down button to set up the brightness and the color temperature. On each side, we get a cold shoe mount, which we can use to install more video lights or some other accessories. In addition, I also installed the Milky Soft cover, which softens the light and the shadows. I really like the included Godox video mic. It's small and compact, but it does the job. The yellow shock mount looks really cool. The shock absorption works simply fine. The sound quality is great. It's definitely a huge improvement over the internal phone mic. Assuming your phone isn't as big as a tablet, it should be compatible with the VLOG kit. You can rather choose between the lighting port, USB-C port and 3.5mm jack model. In my case, I got here the USB-C edition, which includes a USB-C to 3.5mm TRRS cable adapter. I'm using my POCO F3 here which has a 6.67 inch display. Guys, Hassan here. Today I am checking the Godox VK1 VLOG kit on the go. And I am using my POCO F3 today with the external microphone of Godox. I am also using a dead cat which was included in the box. And I have also turned on the Godox 6R lighting. As you can see, it's lighting my face right now. The weather is, isn't that good today. It's rainy and cloudy, but it's okay. It's better than snow in certain situations, but yeah. The tripod is very handy, I can easily hold it, 
I'm glad that the rig isn't made of metal right now because of it's uh, more light and my Poca 3 has a metal aluminium body frame which whites and adds uh, white on the rig so the plastic VK1 is a great choice in this case so I can easily hold my my uh, vlog kit on my right hand and speak while going on the street. So basically, I really like this rig. It's comfortable to hold. The USB-C adapter works pretty fine on my Poco F3, which doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter jack but I can also use other phones which has a 3.5 millimeter jack and yeah basically that's my experience about the Godox VK1 for today I cannot say any negative aspects here it does the job the audio quality of the external mic is much better than the internal mic of my POC F3 and I also tested it before and listened to the audio and I know how it sounds it's pretty good yeah the Godox VK1 is a great vlog kit including a mic and video light there is also an extendable mini tripod which is great to hold your vlog kit while recording. The phone holder has various mounting options such as cold shoe or one quarter inch mounts. The included light is very bright. On the rear we have several buttons to set up the lighting mode, color temperature and brightness. There is also a USB-C port for charging. Additionally, I am also using the Godox 6R light on my Sony A6300 Cineric. I install a 5.5 to 2.5 mm DC to USB-C cable to power the Godox light with my Fieldvolt F5 Pro V2 field monitor. It just works great. In conclusion, it's a great VLOG kit. It's also great for mobile filmmakers because of the several culture mounts. I was able to record more stabilized videos thanks to the Godox VK1 in the cinematic sample video. Did you enjoy the video? Don't forget to subscribe my channel for more great videos. See you!